November 2016, a three-day workshop was given in Nairobi. Participants were members from different organizations working for the disabled. The aim was to develop their understanding how media could be used to further their cause. The participants were engaged in a workshop format covering an introduction of media and storytelling approaches, the choosing of appropriate media formats and the process of organizing and embedding the work in the target population. And that's very important. So then we have these, which is a very simple way of looking at when you get those responses. We all know that communication is distinctive for human. Other animals will communicate. Martin can uh, uh, tell us that uh, he is good in that. Uh, but what I'm saying is that human communication is very uh, unique, distinctive. Uh, and that's why we're very interested in stories. We can also connect in a strange way with the stories. We can cry about somebody else's pain. Basically, a budget is the implementation plan. The implementation plan is the activities and when it's going to happen. The budget is the price tag of the activities. After these introductions, the participants split into small groups to work on different media formats in which to present their cause. <laughs> Whatever we need here, to change the attitude of the police. See, that is what we want. So, we need to change the attitude you need to do that, or you need the involvement of the mental health, the health authority, the involvement of the NGO, the specialized people, money, uh, you know, that, that kind of stuff on the right. The outcome of their efforts were then presented to the others. Um, the enrollment of children with disabilities to learning, to, uh, sorry, there is a delayed enrollment of children with disabilities in learning distribution. It, it, it is uh, really important to change the people's perception how they regard people with special needs or people with disability in the community. So from this, we made a story. And the next part is, um, was to use needle skills to raise funds so that we could get wheelchairs to aid mobility. Coming up is our show. Some went even as far as staging a complete TV show. <laughs> Music playing. <laughs> to, the end, to the other end of the studio is my co-presenter. Are you there? Can you get me? Oh my, my, my. This is good, man. Hey, like this. Man, you gotta hear this, man. From Netherlands. Hank. <laughs> Hank is saying he wants to raise money. <laughs> I mean, I'm excited about this. Oh yes, I'm also excited. Uh, I'm also excited, uh, Mr. Mr. Jeff. Yes, because right now in our country, mm. we've got other good uh, organizations coming up. Really? The Social Disability Services Kenya. Social Disability Services. Kenya. Yeah, you haven't heard about them? No, I'm listening to it very, very, very faster. It's an organization that is fighting for the people living with special needs. And, and you are an ambassador? Yeah. Oh yes. So guys, as we leave today, I just want to tell you that disability is not inability. And never say die. You get a bed. Get, get, get that good man. Thank you so much for our facilitator. And we have doing, been doing media and doing documentaries, but most of the time we don't get feedback. But from whatever we have learned, there are so many things that we need to include, and they will sell out and we get our good feedback. So thank you so much. I never thought of um, stories as that important. You know, I knew, I knew it's important, you know, to share, but it, I, it didn't come to me in my mind, I think because I never had this knowledge before. What I've learned, uh, for the past three days, um, will uh, I'll, I'll, when I go back to my place of work, 
I'll do a lot of work in terms of stories, create stories, and I'm sure, you know, things are going to change for the better. Uh, in my work and wherever I would be, I'll always uh, insist and also train people to appreciate the locally available platforms, which can really work for us and it has the sustainability. The main thing that really came out in our group is the question or the aspect of involving the community. Letting the community tell their story, letting that story guide you in your interventions at every step of that, even going on to the sustainability aspect of whatever project it is that we're thinking about. I would wish that I got more. So in a way, I'm uh, requesting that uh, we also have such uh, forums in future, actually in the very near future, that uh, we can enrich on what we have so that we become the better self and uh, become good advocate for persons with disability. First of all, may I take this opportunity to thank the donors of this program and uh, the CBSK for this wonderful event. Mm -hmm.